such accidents are a frequent occurrence on the Batoka Mamba Road. John Mwila, a truck driver, is happy to have survived this accident, but wants this road worked on. I was trying to avoid an oncoming truck and on the other side the children were fixing the road. So I careered off the road. Other motorists are asking the government to rehabilitate the Batoka Mamba Road under the 2022 budget. We ask the government to rehabilitate this road under the 2022 budget. Enales Maluta is a resident of Siababa village and she attests witnessing a number of accidents on this road. Many motorists find themselves in such accidents because of the bad road. But Southern Province Minister Cornelius Mweto, who recently toured Nazongwe district, assured that the government will work on the economically strategic road. This is a very important road uh, for the economic stability uh, of this country. And therefore, we would like to assure you know, our people that the government who look favorably in consideration of attending to, that, uh, <clears throat> to, the, to this road. And I should be able to report to His Excellency, the President, uh, for his attention. Uh, because there is one spot which I even saw that uh, if it is unattended to, uh, the moment the rains come, the road will be cut out straight away. The Batoka Mamba Road leads to Zambia's largest coal mine. Angela Limonia, ZNBC News in Mamba, Snazongwe District. Remember to hit the like button, place a comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.